runs out of this building. You know, it used to be a, a number of, of these uh, barns, but now it's just consolidated into one. And this is the maintenance pit. Any public transportation yeah. is, has federal funds, and we have to do periodic maintenance. When the cars, the, the wheels wear a little thin, it will they'll be replaced. We replace the whole truck. See, this is the wood brake. This, this is the metal steel brake. There's three brakes on the car, and there's, then there's an emergency brake, which uh, operates a slot brake. Four independent DC motors, driving, each driving a gear reduction, each turning one of these uh, shoes or pulleys. The cable wraps over one, under the other, and then there's another one way down the end of the, this uh, raceway that they move to give the cable tension. Here's the shop where they actually replace the grip rebuild the grip. The grip is the thing that actually contacts the cable and it, it, it transfers the power from the cable to the car to move it down the road. So when we have a car come in um, on, a, on a defect, we call it defects, then usually there's something going on that needs to be fixed right away or it could be a minor. We do minors here, not, not necessarily major work. So this piece actually goes in right here. Actually, I've cut some of it out, but it actually ramps up into this elevation here. Go in here, shoehorn it right inside here. It's raised so the water can actually come out. That's how they've actually designed it 150 years ago. Oh, it's 150 years anniversary, so that's that's what we're doing. 